you see history. Um, what you guys are up against now is something that many of us have encountered, have been encountering for a long time. Um, but the message is that perseverance and uh, refusal to back down does, in the end, make the institution move, so you should be encouraged in your efforts. I speak to you as a member of the Faculty Association. Now, the Faculty Association is uh, an independent group, um, not officially affiliated with the Faculty Senate, um, but a group of faculty which are, most of whom are very concerned about uh, the university, the direction the university is going, and we have uh, organized in order to advance what we think are, are, are causes that are important to the welfare of this institution and to the university community as well as to the larger community of the state as a whole. Um, the individual faculty associations on campuses have representatives at a group, uh, which is the Council of University of California Faculty Associations, COCAPA for short, and that institution, that group, issued a statement the other day, uh, with part of which I'd just like to read to you. Dear colleagues, the Council of UC Faculty Associations supports demands made by the Graduate Student Union, UAW 2865, in its negotiations for new contract and support of the union's right to strike on April 2nd and 3rd that they find it needed to bring negotiations to a speedy and respectful conclusion. Graduate students and instructors are essential to the educational mission of the University of California. Currently, UC graduate student workers are underpaid and have higher workloads than comparable research universities, as is shown by a UC OP study of TA compensation. Ensuring that graduate instructor-led classes are kept at a manageable and consistent size ensures not only equitable treatment for the graduate students, but a high-quality undergraduate learning experience across the University of California. So you see... I should say, um, I was already involved in issues like this back in 2002 when the lecturers faced exactly the similar sort of thing. Unfair labor practices, resistance in, 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 uh, to actually negotiating in good faith. Uh, the lecturers went on strike. That strike was became paid to national attention and brought about a really uh, an extraordinary, as a result, the university backed down and came up with a contract that was much more beneficial than anything lecturers had ever had. So, yeah. you're banding together, your solidarity um, as a group of uh, graduate student TAs, but also the solidarity uh, and support that you receive from the other unions on campus is effective at changing the course of this institution, and that, at getting this institution to to prioritize what is in fact most necessary to be prioritized, to, to contend to what, what, is, what this is, the purpose of this institution really is, and to remain faithful uh, to its mission. Uh, so we on the faculty, there are at least some of us on the faculty who are supportive of, of that aim, um, and we stand with you in your efforts. Uh, our, I, speaking from my own experience, I would just encourage you to, to, to endure in this struggle, and you will be successful at changing this institution and making it more responsible uh, to the communities that it serves. Thank you. Congratulations.